to see you, my dear. You look fabulous. Thank you. Well, now, look, Emma, you have attended some marvellous premieres in your time. How does this compare in Trafalgar Square? I don't think I will ever attend anything like this in my lifetime ever again. I mean, it's it's the scale and the beauty of it and the excitement. I mean, it feels like I don't think this will ever be repeated. It's unprecedented. <laughs> but how does it feel to be walking the red carpet for the last time on a Harry Potter film? A little sad, mixed emotions. I'm feeling so many different emotions. I, I almost, I feel numb. I don't know how to feel. It's, it's so overwhelming. This is, you know, this has been the most significant part of my life. And, and being a part of these films really has sort of defined who I am up until this moment. So it's kind of, it's, it's obviously so sad that it's coming to an end, but I'm so glad that we're going out on such a good, solid film. And, and that, you know, people around the world are still embracing our work. It's amazing after, you know, eight films that people still love it this much. So it's amazing. And you've had, of course, you've had premieres in other locations. What does a London premiere mean to you in particular? Uh, this, I mean, these books are British and the films are British. And, and to have the premiere, the world premiere here in London, in Trafalgar Square, outside the National gallery I mean it couldn't be better this is really the way that the film should have been sent off and I'm just thrilled that you know that it, it's, it's amazing well clearly you can't speak to every fan individually but if you could what would you say to them for the dedication some of them have been camping out in the rain since well two or three nights ago well I just I really feel as though these people have shared this journey with me you know I I grew up making these films and they grew up watching them and and we have that in common and I just, I guess I would just say just again thank you so much for their support and for coming out and I just hope that they love this last film, that it wraps it up really well for them and um, just that, you know, I feel their sadness and I feel their excitement and I'm there with them all the way. Emma, it's been delightful. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Thank you.